okay let's go to the next one the sum of coefficients of the integral powers of x in the binomial expansion of 1 minus 2 root x raised to the power 50 is so the question from binomial theorem we are looking for integral powers of x here in this bracket power of x is half right so we are looking for even powers in the expansion right like nc0 power to this term say 0 then 2 then 4 and so on all those terms would be coming out as with integral power for x correct what we can do to solve this one the required term can be obtained by considering expression 1 minus 2 root x raised to the power 50 plus 1 plus 2 root x raised to the power 50 divided by 2. What we did when we expand it we will be getting alternative plus minus right when we expand this term we will be getting all positive on adding 2 we observe that odd power to root x would be cancelled out correct we get double of the even terms so simply divide by 2 to get the answer so the coefficients we obtain by substituting x equals 1 x equals 1 gives me 3 to the power 50 plus 1 divided by 2 the direct result to this question that is option number 3 so correct answer is option 3 so this is clear what we did we simply have taken another expression 1 plus 2 root x raised to the power 50 we expanded the 2 on addition we find double of the even powers of 2 root x hence the result is obtained by dividing by 2 correct go to the next that is 41 the sum of first 9 terms of the series 1 cube upon 1 plus 1 cube plus 2 cube upon 1 plus 3 plus 1 cube plus 2 cube plus 3 cube upon 1 plus 3 plus 5 and so on is 4 options are given after that so let us consider the general term we can find an term of this series in numerator it will be summation n cube in denominator sum of odd terms so we simply have the result as n n plus 1 upon 2 whole square for numerator and n square for denominator correct so it is 1 by 4 n plus 1 whole square the question is talking about sum of first 9 terms therefore sum of first 9 terms is 1 by 4 times when you put 1 2 3 4 you get 2 square 3 square 4 square up to 10 square if I add and subtract 1 square I get 1 fourth of 10 into 11 into 21 by 6 minus 1 correct we can cancel it like 3 and 5 cancelling further 7 7 5s are 35 into 11 385 minus 1 so finally on simplification it gives me 96 as the answer so correct answer is 96 that is option number 4 that is clear let us go for the next one ok let us go for the next one the area in square units of the reason described by x comma y such that y square less than equal to 2x and y is greater than equal to 4x minus 1 is so a question from integration that is area under the curve let us draw the curve first it is given there one parabola is given y square equals 2x let us consider the strict equation first and a line y equals 4x minus 1 so y square equals 2x 
and y equals 4x minus 1 right we draw the parabola like this and the line when we put x 0 y is minus 1 y 0 then x is 1 by 4 line goes like this right now the question says the area bounded by the curve such that y square is less than equal to 2x means interior of the parabola and y is greater than equal to 4x minus 1. If I put origin, I observe 0 is greater than minus 1. Inequation is satisfied means left side of this line, correct? So, the required area is this one. So, we can find the y coordinates and can integrate with respect to y. So, solving the two curves, we find y square equals twice of y plus 1 upon 4 that is 2y square minus y minus 1 equals 0 solving y equals minus half and 1. Therefore, the required area is minus half to 1 line minus parabola x line minus x parabola dy. So, it is minus half to 1 from line it is y plus 1 upon 4 minus from parabola it is y square by 2 dy. Simply integrate to get the result as 1 by 8 y plus 1 whole square minus half to 1 minus 1 by 6 times y cube minus half to 1. So, simply substitution of the limits to get the required result that comes out as 9 by 32 square units. So, just simplification of this term. So, we get the answer as 2. So, this is clear. So, let us move to the next question of this paper now.